Hey everybody, today I'm working on a 12 by 12 canvas and the other day during my live giveaway I did a boiler maker for the first time. So today I thought I would do another one. Um, in honor of the 4th of July I'm going to be doing red, white, and blue colors. And the first color that I have is from Liquitex and that is Thalo Blue. And also my next color from Liquitex is um, Pyrrole Crimson. And then I have White Pearl from Folk Art. So I already have my cup ready of the pearl white. And let me get my gloves on and we'll get started. Okay guys, so I'm just going to take my little shot glass and I'm just gonna pour some blue first in the bottom. All my colors are mixed with Liquitex pouring medium, Floetrol, and water, and I'm not adding any silicone. Um, now I'm just going to take a little bit of the white, just a little bit. Now I know these colors are going to mix, so I'm going to end up with, you know, some other colors there. So we'll see. We'll see. I feel like I have a little bit more red than blue. So I'm just going to put a little bit more red or a little bit more blue on top there. All right. So now I'm just going to go ahead and drop that in. What's that? It's not going down there. <laughs> all right. We'll push that down all the way to the bottom there. Okay. So I'm just going to take it and flip it. Alright, so now I'm just going to lift this first cup. Oh, it tipped over. <laughs> That's alright. I think I'll set that right there. Alright, and now while those are sitting there, I'm just going to pop some of these air bubbles. Some of them are stubborn, but I'll get them. All right, so we'll lift that up. Okay. All right, so now I'm just going to go ahead and start moving it around. I'm kind of going to go in a circle at first just to kind of get everything covered. I don't really want to lose all that blue right there. So I'm going to go back this way a bit. I'm going to run that off though. There we go. I'm gonna leave that. All right, I'm gonna run this back to the middle a bit. All right, I'll set it down now. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and go over it real quick. Okay guys, so it's been about 20 minutes and there's all kinds of cells. Looks really cool. It's kind of wispy looking. There's something cool happening there in the red. Can't really get any closer, but it looks kind of cool. And I got some other colors. I got some purple and some pink. Of course I knew that was going to happen. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and let it dry and then I'll be back. All right, sit tight. Okay guys, so here's the painting all dry. I just wanted to show you first before I go in for a close up. I did turn the painting and you, I don't know if you can see this, but what I see is um, a woman 
like and it's mainly where all the cells are it's not um, the outline of a woman there's her shoulder her neck and her face I think it looks really cool and then all of that above it and next to it looks like her hair is blowing kind of crazy in the wind so that's what I see I'm not sure if you guys see that but that's what I see all right so I'll take you in a little closer I think it looks pretty cool. I love how the colors blended. And I just love how the all the cells are like concentrated to make it look like a person. I, I think it looks really cool. All right. So there it is, the red, white, and blue boiler maker. Thank you guys for watching, and I hope you all have a safe and happy 4th of July.